Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Leo February 9, 2022. You may discover today that you have a talent for something you've never even thought about. If you always stick to what you know, how will you ever experience anything new? Trying your hand in this unexplored area does not mean that you have to excel at it straight away. As long as you have fun doing it, it will be a positive experience no matter how successful you are. Don't be scared go for it. Mind your manners today, and make sure your charm dial is turned up to high. You will find that merging with the group is an essential piece of the puzzle as you keep a momentum of energy going. The more the merrier. Once you get the ball rolling in the right direction, there will be plenty of momentum helping it to roll up the next hill. The important thing is that you take responsibility for all of your actions. Your mental scheming is hard at work today, and you are on the verge of sending yourself down a dark pit of complete confusion and frustration. Work to balance out the issues, and take things one step at a time. Prioritize your objectives and write them down for future reference. Try not to take your frustrations out on others, but instead work to focus your attention inward and bring consciousness to your powerful mental processes. You have a strong outer-directed drive today that will help you conquer a great deal in just about every situation you encounter. Keep in mind, however, that there is likely to be a strong opposing force that wants to hold you back from your goals. There is virtually no limit to the weight you can bear. You have an incredibly powerful will that can withstand a tremendous amount. Don't let small obstacles get in your way. Jupiter will cross your sky, prioritizing your family relationships. Above all, you will be very close to your children, whom you will nurture more than ever. With your spouse, the deal should be almost perfect. Think that small gifts foster friendship and large gifts foster love, French proverb. Now is the time to spoil someone who loves you and won't deny you anything. Someone close is asking you what's going on, and you're not totally sure. That doesn't mean you should stay quiet, though make sure at least to try to talk things out with them. Pay attention to the slightest reactions from your interlocutors. Don't worry today about the things that you still need to get done. You need to figure out why you fill your time up with so many tasks, leaving little room in your life to relax. Today's energy will help you learn how to nourish yourself more and decide what needs to be changed in your schedule. It shouldn't be hard to begin with some small changes, like exercising more or planning several nights off during the week. You can be very passionate about your beliefs. You have a clear sense of right and wrong, and you don't have any problem sharing your opinions with others. Today you could be inspired to express yourself in a bold way. Maybe your sense of justice will be triggered. You could be stirred by something that you see or hear. You might want to step in and show people a different way of looking at things. The time to knuckle down and get some work done is at hand. In fact, you'll probably notice that you can't think of anything else but what you need to do. This is part of the day's magic. Your concentration and stamina will be strong, and handling challenges will seem much easier than usual. Even if you have made other plans, consider changing things around so you can take full advantage of the day's energy to get things done. If the moon's departure from Aries yesterday has left you buzzing and feeling more excited about the coming year than you have until now, you can thank the dwarf planet Eris direct turn and your over-the-horizon radar for that. This has been your first chance to get an intuitive read on what lies ahead and as what lies ahead is Mars, the warrior planet and your ruling planet's first visit to Aries in two years and lucky Jupiter's first in 12 years, there are expansive times ahead. With a romantically charged full moon next week and the moon's return to your relationship sector just a few days later, it is next week that both matters of the heart and your relationships will get a boost. Until then, this week is more about having the communication lines open and while that will kick off from tomorrow, today is more about committing to making this a priority. Your tarot reading for today. Death, the Fool and the Empress. The cards show the possibility of forming a new couple, in February 2022. The man with whom it will be possible has already been around you for a long time. His feelings are sincere and he might be the right one for you. 
His intentions are positive and he is a loving and caring person. Neither of you need this new couple at the moment. Neither of you are emotionally unhappy and it is this that will allow this possible couple to have a healthy basis. You will be able to flourish in a life together with him. At the same time, you will be able to preserve your independence because you will be free to continue your life as you wish. Each of you will be able to have external activities without either of you seeing it as a problem or feeling jealous. A good balance that will normally mean you start on good foundations. The result will be a couple that can last, close and strong. The cards show that this new couple is not a foregone conclusion, however. Even if the person has many qualities, your life together will not necessarily be easy from the start. There will probably be an adjustment period during which your two strong personalities will have to get to know each other and learn to live together. The cards do not say that you have to form this new couple, they just say there will be a possibility, it's up to you to do it or not, depending on your current situation. The moon glides into the sign of Capricorn today, making it a reflective time to assess life and make decisions about the best way to move forward. Uranus, retrograde in Taurus, and the healing centaur Chiron, retrograde in Aries, connect with the moon, which creates an intuitive perspective giving us the opportunity to implement growth and change in our lives. In order to get started on your path, it's important to take steps to heal from past trauma. The caveat is that this might be uncomfortable and awkward, especially given the Chiron retrograde is making a tense and fraught aspect with the Capricorn moon. Some emotions will be triggered from this lunar energy, making us want to run away and hide. Instead of ignoring or avoiding problems, it's imperative that you deal with them head on. Then you can take action to mend past emotional upsets, disappointments, and heartaches. Uranus retrograde gives us a chance to take a different approach in such matters, which is very helpful and useful. Our old emotional reactions will no longer benefit or suit us, giving us the opportunity to find new emotional responses and understanding. Open your heart and mind to fresh and novel approaches to transcend to a higher vibration and way of thinking. In the pre-dawn hours, the moon enters Capricorn, ending its void of course that began last night. Over the next two days, as the moon waxes, we should expect some stabilization of eclipse energies. This doesn't mean that events won't continue to occur that shift our trajectory or force us to evolve our way of thinking. But under the Capricorn moon, we have an instinctive way of putting one foot in front of the other without stumbling into overwhelm. Patience and persistence will see us through our struggles if we refuse to let fear interrupt our progress.